How cool is this? I bought this faulty from eBay. It cost me this much. And it's untested, obviously. Well, let's test it, shall we? We'll do your job for you. Nice. Well, let's see what it's doing. Tape radio. Tape. It's doing absolutely nothing. There's a shock. Right, well, let's open it up and let's see if we can figure out what's going on. It's got some discoloration on this handle. It's kind of gone a bit pink. I'm guessing it's supposed to be red. I don't know whether there's anything I can do about that, but let's see if we can get it working first. Right, I can tell it's going to have bags of power. These are 1 watt speakers. It does have separate tweeters though, which is nice. There's a little ceramic capacitor attached to it. Right, so we've got no power, have we? So, ah, you know what I should have done? I should have left the batteries in. Damn. Let's see if we can get this tape mechanism out and then we can see the circuit board a bit better. Obviously those screws are different sizes. Great. Hmm, there's, there's not a lot of room to play with here. Well, there's the belt. Well, that looks fine. Which is surprising. I mean, I don't know how old this is. I'm guessing it's 90s, judging by the look of it. Okay, so we've got power in here and we've got and then it goes to this board here so there's two points here where it connects to the board we've got a red wire and a black wire oops as always let's check the simple things first multimeter and continuity which is the mode that beeps when we get a complete circuit All right okay so we can see the the red wire goes from here and then it goes up here and into this yes okay so it goes from here into here. So this is obviously some kind of transformer. Yes, it can be mains powered as well, which is here. Right, so the positive wire seems to be okay. Okay, well let's check the negative, which goes to here. And that goes, is that this? Yes, it is, but that's not, that's just connected to the board. That's not connected to the, should be here. Ah. <laughs> I think I found the problem. This isn't connected to the battery terminal there. And that's why we always check the simple things first. <laughs> right, let's go ahead and reattach this. Hopefully it doesn't need a new wire. No, that looks fine. this works, is it going to be my easiest fix ever? Very possible. Well, let's see if we can get this back in without breaking it. Oh, I think it works. Oops. I've not put this back together fully, just in case. But obviously, you, you just heard it work. Get back into the game, so we will have to be ready. Nice. This is Newsbeat, back at 1.30. On your radio. 
Awesome. Let's try tape. And what better way to test it than with Here We Go by Stacker Bow. £2.29 from Woolworths. It works. Well, considering that was the easiest fix ever, I should probably try and make this look as good as I possibly can. It's already in pretty good condition, but I'm going to give it a good clean. It's got some scratches on the tape cover here, the plastic. We've also got a bit of chipped paint on the grills here. Let's give it a good clean. I'm just going to use a sharpie to colour in the grill. You can see we've got bits missing here, a few around here and here. Let's just see what this sharpie does. Nice. Well there we go. That looks miles better, doesn't it? Do the other one. Here, here. A mm. couple of other bits over here. So simple, but so effective. Right now, we're going to get the scratches out of this. They're not massively visible on the camera. There you go, you see them there. I've heard people say you can use toothpaste, baking soda. I'm going to give it a go. I've never tried that before. Don't believe it. I think it's an old wives' tale. But let's give it a go. Ah, the perfect amount of toothpaste. Okay, it wasn't the perfect amount. I need more. Well, even if it doesn't clean it, at least it's going to be minty fresh. No, looks the same to me. Maybe slightly better. Right, let's see if we can do anything about this handle. Again, is toothpaste going to make any difference? Probably not. Definitely not. The other thing people say to use is baking soda. Let's try that. Just going to mix some together in this little dish. No, it doesn't work either. The other thing I've seen people do is heat these up with like a blowtorch. You know, you watch those videos and you just think that's just utter nonsense. I mean, maybe it does work, but I just don't want to risk it. I'll probably just end up melting the handle. <laughs> I think I'm just going to leave it pink. <laughs> if anybody knows a way to restore colour to plastics, please let me know. Put it in the comments section. There we go. I think it's cleaned up really nice. I really like the look of it. Let's put some YouTube music in that isn't going to get me a copyright strike. Alright, doesn't actually sound that bad considering it's one watt speakers. Stupid. Untested boots SRR 15 thing with a pink handle thing. <laughs>